But before we start anything, what we want to do is go over to here, because since the plan is to, you know, make the Wither Skulls and Varm, to get another skull, to make a Wither, to get a, like, Wither Star or another star, to get a beacon, um, to, you know, get Haste 2 and, and take down the fortress a bit quicker, um, and then obviously get more Wither Skulls and Skulls and etc, etc. Uh, I need to kind of look in here and see if I have enough like, it's, what, it's two stacks and 36, I think it is? So, we nearly have three stacks of iron blocks worth in here. So, okay, that definitely, uh, we will have enough blocks. Because I was thinking we could use emerald at first. But I realized I have a stack and 42 of them. Um, well, technically a stack and 40 spare, if I don't want to ruin my chest sorting. Um, so, in that, in that regard, you know, it's kind of a case of... Uh, it's probably better to go with iron. Because, I don't know, I, our iron's being passively generated, whereas our, you know, emeralds takes our input to do that. Um, so, depends depends on what you want to do. And also, since I made some pumpkin pies, I want to see what this is like. 64 and 15, uh, well, and 5, not 15. Not as bad as I thought, I just kind of forgot that. I haven't been on here in a while, to be fair. Uh, so haven't really had the chance to have a look too much into it. I have actually been on a little bit though, but mainly in the nether, so it's not really been uh, generating anything while I've been here, because I've been trying to get a last skull, because I was planning on recording a video today here, but I couldn't find a skull. So the plan is to get another skull um, at some point tonight, hopefully, and uh, be able to do that for next time I'm able to record, which should be in like two days' time. And, um, yeah, hopefully everything works out. So, as I said, we have not got a um, actual farm here. The plan is to have, well, the crossroads are here and here, which kind of sucks because it's kind of in this big netheracky area. Uh, but the plan is to just have these kind of base layers where stuff should be able to spawn, obviously. Um, they're not really complete at the moment, so it's not really going to be all that useful. Uh, let's see if I can get that going. Yes, I can. Good. So, basically, the bottom layer, this layer, and a layer beneath it, which is three layers beneath it. So, if we're here, we are 57, so 54Y and 60Y, which is that one, we can have any block, but the layer above that, or any layers above that, or below that, uh, those three layers have to be made out of nether brick. Uh, I thought originally nether brick slabs, but I learnt today that it was actually just pure nether brick it had to be, so we will, in fact, have to deal with that. Um, no, we can't make it up there, which, that kind of sucks. Let me get rid of this one block. I'm going to put it there, so I can actually get up here. So yeah, this one is at 60. Uh, so the next one's going to have to be, I think it's 64, I think. Um, if I'm, because we have to add like an extra layer of slabs underneath and on top just to get everything working. So I have a ton of stone slabs. For now I'm going to be going stone slabs just because I have a lot of them, even though I was thinking to myself the real reason I'm doing that is because I don't want to have to smelt stuff into uh, stone brick slabs. But then I realize you don't, you know, there's no real difference between stone slabs and stone brick slabs other than the fact you have one more crafting. Uh, sort of layer in it where you just have to put some brick together or some stone, smooth stone together to put into the stone brick to make the the slabs. So, yeah. I uh, don't exactly know what I was on about there. So, uh, I just have a ton of these left over for the moment because I just used a ton. So, I'm just going to hold on to these for the moment, use them up. Um, and then, what I might end up doing most likely is because these kind of don't connect at all, I might rip them out, put in stone brick slabs, and then use these to slab up the environment. Or um, I'm going to have... There's going to be layers outside of these anyway for the uh, sort of observation layers, so I might use them there instead. I'm not 100% sure oh, how I'm going to do that. But hopefully everything works out stupendously well. Well, let's just pick this up. Nope, didn't give us our thing we wanted, because we had 
That's one thing I hate about mending. It like because I have this and this that are full in durability, there's a chance it won't mend anything and it will just go to uh my XP amount. Which I guess is kind of nice slightly, but it's annoying when I wanna in a kind of hostile environment heal up my armor or my sword. Especially because that sword doesn't have no breaking on it. You know. So I've also thought of a few things we have to do, because the plan for this area um, as a whole is have it be kind of the, the bare necessities, not going to go into the Jungle Book song, but basically the uh, plan is take out this blaze, that's the first plan. Uh, entrance is via this area here, so what's eventually going to happen is I think I'm going to get rid of this stairway and just flatten this out. Get rid of everything up here. Uh, possibly, well, the big sort of pipe dream, I guess, would be fill it in with nether rack, but that's probably not going to happen. Hello. I needed to jump to kill you in one hit. Damn it. Um, would be, yeah, fill this in with nether rack where, where wantable, where it looks all right or where nether rack would be as a, a natural thing. Um, and then, oh, please don't do this to me. Uh, and then, you know, just. Um, yeah, just fill it in there the right where needed, but that's probably not going to happen at least for a very long time. But the plan is probably to you know get rid of that, flatten this out, uh, cut off that area, cut off this area, pick up this experience uh, into my bow, I think, or nothing. Um, but yeah, cut off this area because we're not going to go down there. Cut off that because we're not going to go down there. Uh, this, this, cut off, and just probably I'll probably leave that there to be honest. Um, Uh, yeah, so I'll probably leave this here as a nice little entranceway. I'll probably lower that down a bit, uh, and then cut off that, obviously, kind of exit off this area. Well, even though the plan is to go three blocks out from here in each direction for a, a little pathway thing. Uh, and then, obviously, block off everything here, uh, block off that. And because we're going to be building a blaze spawner there, or blaze farm thing there, this is going to have to be accessible from the end of the farm and then go over to here for that, uh, which I just realized is a bit awkward because I've got to go three blocks out here and then kind of make it part of it. So it might have to be slightly different than I want it to be. So it might be a case of it being like here and then going that way instead of, you know, just following with what we already have. But again, that's kind of a, a long way away. Today is just kind of, as I said, the bare bones of this whole thing getting done. Hopefully having a working-ish farm by the end of it. It's not going to be entirely working because for it to be entirely working, I need to slab like 128 blocks in each direction. Um, you know, just to rid spawning away um, and stuff like that. But... That's definitely not happening today or anytime fairly soon. Uh, but one good thing is because of the way this server is set up, um, we kind of just don't have to worry about like kind of getting in anybody's face, uh, which is very, very nice. One of the things I really like about the sort of way we have it set up here, uh, because you know we're, we're all so far away anyway, and then on top of that, it's just a case of, um, yeah, we're all far away from each other, but on top of that, that means our nethers are super far from each other, which means, generally, we're all right. Um, or at least I'd like to think that I'm not really going to encounter anybody uh, or anybody's sort of structures and kind of have them being like, oh, well, that sucks. That said, though, the nether is, like, eight times smaller, technically, than the nether, because each step, each one step here is eight, well, each one block here is eight blocks in the overworld. So, if you maybe, like, if there was someone who was maybe 8,000 blocks away, there would be, like, a 1,000 from us, but even so, you know, when we're doing 128 by 128, we're not going to meet those guys. Uh, within that, we're only like an, a tenth, obviously, away from them, or, you know, 
in that face area. There's two guys over there. I need to go take a care of them in a second. I cannot wait until I get a beacon. I will be so happy. In fact, if I get this is my whole thing, I'm going to be upset. Oh, well, I was about to say I'm going to be upset, but I'm going to be happy. Ah, there we go. All right, let's quickly go return this guy. Uh, I don't want to die. I'm pretty sure I was here originally, and I had like three of them or two of them. Um, and I died. That was actually one of my first deaths, I think, uh, was when that happened. Oh, I'm just going to go quickly take care of this guy. Because having a smite sword is super nice when you're here. Another good thing about this, uh, this farm is it's good for, like, pretty much every, like, you know, drop, almost. Um, because Pikmin will spawn, and when we get a strength beacon, that'll be nice, because then we can just kill these guys in one hit no matter what. Um, let's just pick up this XP. Uh, you'll get, obviously, Wither Skeletons, which will be an easy kill. Uh, with Strength, you'll get Blazes, so you get Blaze Rods, which are good for, obviously, uh, you know, smelting stuff, which is nice. And then we'll also get, um, uh, Lava Slimes, Magma Slimes, or Magma Cubes, and, uh, we'll be able to, you know, have those guys doing their job, uh, and dying. Even though they're kind of less of a priority, because they're a pain to kill, um, when we are killing everything else in one hit, and then you take, like, multiple hits to kill that thing. Like, even my Sharpness 5 Sword can't even kill a cube, like, the littlest cube in one hit sometimes. Um, I think it's just one of the, uh, the, the, like, sword mechanics from 1.9, or was it 1.10? I can't remember. Um, I think it was 1.9 when they added that. I might be mistaken. We'll have to think about it later. Whoa, I have no idea what my screen just did, and I'm worried about it. I'm gonna get out of there. Let's just... Okay. <laughs> Hopefully everything is fixed now. Now I have to find my other ones. I think they're there. Yep, three of those guys. I'm gonna put these away somewhere else, I think. Actually, no, I'm gonna leave them there, because that's actually where I knew they were, so... They can go up there, though. Actually, no. I'll go back where they were. So three of those guys... Happy about that. Good. So if if not anything else out of today, we got our third Wither Skeleton Skull, which means I am able to do a Wither Fight in the near future. Not today, though, because I am focusing on that for a video, uh, mainly. I just didn't get to record it today because I didn't... I just wasn't lucky. Nothing was spawning. Um, though that's really the thing we're sorting out today, is getting a new... Uh, or adding more spawning platforms, you know, giving a you know, more of an ability to spawn, so we can get more of those, maybe we can get like six, nine, uh, maybe we can do multiple kills at a time, which will be pretty damn cool. Um, so, the way this is going to end up having to work in the future is, um, as I said, everything kind of like three blocks out, so let's say here, so one, two, three, it's going to be like that, which should basically mean that anything spawning here shouldn't be able to, like, get... Well, Wither Skeletons won't be able to get up here, and I don't think... Well, no, it's not that they can't get up there, so they don't pathfind up to there, because it's on a half slab or something. Um, so we will be able to come up here, be safe from, you know, Pigmen, Wither Skeletons, Blazes. Uh, I think Baby Slimes obviously can get through it, um, quite obviously. Uh, but, yeah, should be pretty safe, and uh, obviously as well, because it's two and a half high, the... Um, uh, the Wither Skeletons can't actually attack us, or they're not supposed to be able to, like, uh, realize we're there to attack us, which is why earlier, you may have noticed, I do not want to hit that pigment, uh, there was kind of one that was, like, in between, like, there was, a uh, an under, I, we were under it, and they were, they were in a gap, and they couldn't actually, well, they weren't actually trying to get to us, and I think that's why that happened, please don't hit the pigman, okay, which is worried that he might just randomly move, knowing how pigmen do things around here. So that's that one done. Uh, how do we want to do the second one? Do we want to go to this now, I think, maybe? Um, so it's kind of one layer thing. Originally, I wanted this all to be nether brick slabs, but I think if I want to identify the layers, it's probably best that we don't do that. Actually, it might be interesting to see how we're going to lay this out. So this is going to be the like, go in area, that's going to be a bit of a worry, so that's three blocks in, and then we got to think how we get into the second layer, so, 
second layer is gonna have you know half slabs there and obviously we'll get rid of this as well get all those three and they're extra uh, so we're gonna have to make some I guess stairs we could probably make stairs going up like that possibly like um, let's see which means we'll probably have to get rid of this so if we get rid of that, or lower it down a level, maybe. Or we're going to be up a level, aren't we? And this is also going to be up a level, I've realized. So that's not exactly going to work. That's going to look ugly. Ugh. Maybe it's the case that we could bring the lava up a layer. Possibly. Maybe. Um, but yeah, if we're going to have stairway like that... I have a worry that it's just going to look kind of ugly for the most part, which we don't mind too much, but if I can stay away from it being super ugly, that would be nice. So let's just do this a second and see what it looks like. Dun, dun, dun. There we go. That'll hopefully be stairs. That would be the plan as well. And obviously, as well, everything here will be half slabbed on the bottom side, so nothing can spawn on it. And obviously, stairs would help with that. Uh, but the question then is, how do we get, you know, um, get up to the next layer? So, what I'm thinking we might be able to do is... Hmm... If we can find the middle and build from there, maybe? I'm not sure. Like, we could quite easily recreate this build. Like, this corridor as a whole. Like, go through here. Um, and then move further in. I do like this, though. I do like being... Like, just this feels a bit more natural, because I know it's always there. It's just the stairway that's our issue. So, what we could have is just kind of a one layer up, like go up that way sort of thing. But then we've got to think about a layer down. We could actually do that. We could have stair there, stair there, but start like that layer in, maybe. Or even just start here. Um, so we have our kind of entrance and our entrance and our entrance like three blocks wide, possibly. Hmm. I'm not sure how it'll look, though. Let's check. How about we do that? <laughs> Instead of just being like, oh, I wonder. Let's actually try it. So, if we start from here, now the brick stairs here. For the, well, imagine nether brick stairs there. Hmm. Let's get that. worried about how this can look at the end but do we have a crafting bench no damn this could work though kind of um, but it needs to go three layers back this does I think before entrance preferably So it might have to go one layer back. Which I think is alright, actually. So, let's do that. Right. There we go. Let's put this back. And there we go. Because then we have three layers back from that. And everything should be good. And I just realized that's going to have to go anyway. Huh. 
So this top layer is going to have to pretty much get sawn off from here. I think is the plan. Serves me right, I guess. Right. Okay. Shouldn't have, like, just quickly gone to check something whilst I was basically AFKing in a hostile zone. So, blame's on me. I'm just trying to think about how we want to build this thing. Because I don't want this being, like... That looks ugly. <laughs> like, as a whole. It looks absolutely abysmal. So, I'm trying to think about how we want to get it done. <laughs> so, we could maybe do like a sort of uh, it's just like stairs diagonally up, coming up to here, sort of thing, just to make the room look bigger, but not necessarily to make the room bigger. Just, you know, the illusion of it being uh, bigger than that could be a good idea. But I'm not 100% sure how we want to do that. Come on. Come on. Float down there. No, or not. Float up there. Fine. Ah, right, okay. So for the moment then, I think what we're just going to do is this should be as far as it goes. So I'm going to go up to here. And the plan, I think, is for the moment then to... I need some nether break quickly, or nether rack quickly. Just to kind of fill in this gap. It looks weird. And replace that salt sand. Um, so what I'm going to do, I think, is just kind of carve away at this for a little bit. And then I didn't really necessarily think the stream was going to be too long, but I might end it off uh, just for that. I mean, we've got our nether, um, you know, our, our wither skull, which is kind of the big thing for today. So I'm not sure. But either way, let's get started with this. Oh... And I have a lot of cell sound of this, of this at the end. At least. Right. Oh. God. No, no. Right. Good thing I brought that. There we go. Uh. I've held on to that for so long. I'm so glad. Oh, God. Alright. Now we need to get up there. Oh, there's a will skeleton. Let's go kill it. Quickly. While I'm still on fire. <laughs> and now withered. Ugh. Well, at least stuff is spawning on here. That's nice. Anything down here? Nope. I definitely need to replace this, though. I'm going to do that eventually. Eventually. I think priority is probably going to be try and get up there and carve it the way I'm talking about doing it. Ugh. Come on. Come. Really? So close. So close. Right. There we go. Hopefully that's a bit better. Right, so I'm going to go somewhere safe a minute and then uh, think about doing cement.
Alright, so let's get up to the overworld and see what we get done. I had to make a quicker way getting up these stairs. I had to be so fancy and do slabs, didn't I? Though if I get speed, um, you know, beacon sorted out, then maybe I could do a bit better. Right, though, I think, uh, you know, we've got our wither skull, and uh, I'm a bit under-equipped, I think, for what I wanted to do, so I'm probably going to end off, we did about half an hour, uh, just trying to slowly get back into streaming, actually. It's been about, like, two, three weeks, so just wanted to slowly get back into it. So, um, yeah, I'm going to end off for now, but I will uh, strive to do some more streams in the future. But, yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.